Hey there, everyone, and thank you so much for joining me for yet again another amazing event here for my World Lymphedema month-long celebration. I do have Lindsay Ryback with me with Ellen R, and she's going to talk all about the products that we love and use. Let me introduce to you Lindsay Ryback. Hello, Lindsay. How are you? Hi, doing well. Nice to see you, Amanda. Nice to have everybody here tonight. We are very excited to have you here. So why don't you tell us a little bit about who you are and how you got into LNR and being able to just give us this opportunity to talk to you today? Absolutely. So uh, my name is Lindsay Ryback, and I'm the Senior Product Manager of Compression at LNR USA. Um, I actually, I had a, a kind of a fun story. I actually joined um, Solaris, which is the company that LNR had acquired um, back in 2014. So it's almost eight years now. And I actually did a school project at a local university and got to pick any company I wanted. And I heard the words lymphedema for the first time and then garments and wraps and bandaging. And I just was really intrigued by the company. I made a marketing plan for them and that same um, semester I graduated and I actually took my first job right out of college uh, working for Solaris. And then from there, I ended up um, then being a part of the LNR family because that same year they got acquired uh, by LNR, another family owned company. And so now a part of this global group here, but it's been such a journey and I've just had such a privilege to meet so many people across the world um, who, not only have lymphedema or treat lymphedema or maybe manufacture products that help patients as well. So it's just been really such a cool journey. Um, and uh, so that's kind of how I ended up here. And so I'm based in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And today we're here actually in the headquarters. That's really great. Um, so Lindsay and I, we were talking a little bit before, before we met today, and we were just talking about how advanced lymphedema is becoming. I believe when I was diagnosed in 2001, very little information was known. And Lindsay, do you want to tell us, tell them the story that you're telling me, uh, the short condensed version based on just <laughs> being noticeable and being aware of this condition and how it is impacting so many people out there? Absolutely. So yeah, I, I called uh, Amanda, we were just catching up this morning. And um, it's interesting to just see how many people are affected with lymphedema. And, you know, it's funny, because before I joined LNR, didn't know what this word even meant, never heard of it before. And then yesterday, I went to the seamstress, um, she was fixing some of my dresses, I flow my arms up a little bit. And so sometimes get holes in my dresses. So I went to go to my seamstress who I've been going to since I was in maybe eighth grade. And I ended up seeing that she had a pump and I was like, Hmm. Then I saw some wound care dressings. They weren't, they weren't uh, our wound care dressings at LNR, but, um, did see those. And then I was just kind of asking a couple questions without wanting to pursue too much. And before I know it, I was there for an hour and a half after looking at the products I need, needed to get, you know, her seamstress work done to and talking about her condition. And she had really kind of gone undiagnosed, misdiagnosed and had all the wrong compression products, you know, more in circular knit versus flat knit and things like that. And she's been actually getting worse. And so being there, I was able to connect her with a local therapist of who she should reach out to, started talking about product options that would be maybe suitable for her. And she had felt this sense of hope when I left and we hadn't even accomplished anything at that point in terms of, you know, getting her in the right products, but she felt like, man, I've never even met someone who's heard of this before. And now there's someone here that understands and, you know, is able to, you know, help me. And so it was one of those things that, you know, part of the thing that I love about my job is that, you know, you, you come into these situations on a regular basis and you know that like the work that you can do can really help impact someone's life and sharing stories and sharing experience is really just and such a great thing. And I think that's exactly why we're here. And this is why I have such a huge passion to do these webinars and to have people such as yourself to come in and to help to educate. Cause if you don't know, you just don't know. And again, I'm just very grateful that you're here. Show us the differences between the products and show us what we need to know. Because again, a lot of garment fitters are actually not privileged to knowing everything that is out there, which again, it, it's not, it's not their fault. It's just, I think with the term lymphedema itself, it was so under-recognized and it started to gain traction 
But again, getting access to these garments and these products and the knowledge behind them. Again, you guys have a front row second, front row seat ticket to getting to know what's out there. So again, thank you for joining us. Um, further ado, why don't we get into LNR, the company itself? A little bit about LNR. So LNR is a global manufacturer and supplier. So we have a presence throughout the entire world. Um, and we have been manufacturing wound care products as well as compression therapy garments for over 160 years. So a really strong history. Um, so you can really be confident in these products because they have really withstood the test of time uh, being able to support patients and they continue to evolve and to develop. Um, Lohman and Rauscher has US presence, US headquarters in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, which is where I am right now. Um, we also have a headquarters in um, Canada as well. We here, we here um, have purchased now Solaris back in 2014, which is the company I came from. And so not only do we then have the compression bandages and the wound care, but now we have all of the compression therapy garments, wraps and products like that, as well as some circular neck garments within the Venus Sand range, which was, was acquired a few years after that. Fascinating. And it's really nice to know what that it has such a vast history. But I also think too, it's funny because um, it's nice to know that LNR is always trying to advance and trying to grow with the times and trying to always improve. It didn't just create one product and just stay stagnant. All these products, and as Lindsay and I get into it, they're always tweaking, they're always advancing, they're always trying to get the best products out there for you guys. So without that being said, why don't we jump in to our very first product? Over here, so you're gonna quickly realize that we've got a mannequin that's taller than I am. I'm five feet tall. She's about six feet here. But what <laughs> she's playing for us today is she is head to toe in Tribute Night. And so the reason we like to dress her head to toe is because Tribute Night is 100% custom, evening, nighttime, low activity garment, but lymphedema presents everywhere from head down to the toe. So that is why Tribute Night is going to be able to be able to address all of those areas. And I'm gonna interrupt you because again, it's very important for those people that have head and neck edema, trunkal edema, uh, genital edema, but it is important for people who have head and neck and trunkal edema and genital edema to know that there are garments in the market that are meant to combat your swelling. So let's take it away, Lindsay. I'll pass it over to you and Trinity there. Okay, so Trinity is gonna show off this head and neck. So Esme, if you wanna maybe zoom in a little bit, you can see here, we've got this nice V shape and that's called our chevron channeling. And this type of channeling is actually has this foam technology built in so that's nestling into the tissue. It's giving it that micromassage effect, breaking up that fibrosis, helping keep the skin healthy. You've got some nice adjustability built in. And then the chevron channeling is actually helping direct that fluid, like your MLD principles, to move it in the areas that you want to direct it to based on those same principles. So for example, chevron is typically going to be for your collateral pathway direction. And then for primary lymphedema, you're going to use more of a vertical channeling. Um, but that is the mandibular unit here, but you can see it's just really nice, really adjustable. It's going to be a lower profile design. So I know if people have used the original profile before, you can see it's just a lot thinner. If you select that, it's a simple checkbox on the form for your fitter. You can see here, we've got a nice little vest that she's covering. You can do fun things like a zipper. You can do these like Velcro. So you can see this one actually has both built in. And so you can actually do things to customize it to make it really be the best thing for you because every single one of these garments that we design is 100% custom. And so it's made specifically for whoever the garment is being made for. And so whatever accommodations need to be hap happening to the garment, we can do. You can see here, if you want easy bathroom accessibility, we can build all of that into the garment so that we can make it really functional for you because it's not only supposed to be effective, it's also supposed to be able to help you really live your life. Um, and so not having any of that hindering. You can see we've got arm sleeves. You can see we've got pants, one with a long leg, one with a short leg, depending on you know how, how the lymphedema is presenting itself. So it's pretty cool, pretty versatile. And you can see we've got some fun colors, which I'll fan out here that you can see black slate, blue, raspberry, purple. And then you can also, like I said, check your um, profile height. So you can see here, you've got your more pillowy 
type original profile or you've got your like lower profile design. So when I first got diagnosed with lymphedema, I was absolutely not having any of the medical garments or, or options out there. I was like looking at all these things and I'm thinking, oh my goodness, it looks like a spacesuit. Um, I didn't quite understand the functionality or the purpose for these garments. When I got actually, my very first custom fit garment was a tribute uh, night garment. And it's amazing just the, the massaging effect that you do get from these garments. If you suffer from fibrosis or if you're constantly swelling and you really want to eat away at that edema, I would highly recommend any of these products that come in this tribute foam self-massaging garment. Can you tell people out there, are these garments only for nighttime or can they be daytime? Or would, would, give us some feedback on your opinion on when these garments can be used. So I will first off say I always start every time that I am explaining this type of a concept to say, like how lymphedema is lifelong, you also need to remember that lymphedema is not just a daytime condition. And so um, you do need to wear it at night to be able to contain it. But for example, if maybe it's Sunday morning and you wanna be drinking coffee, hanging out, watching the news, or maybe watching a show that might sound more fun. Um, and so being able to do something, you can do it whenever you're in low activity mode. If you're working remote, if you're just hanging out, it's kind of like keeping on your sweatpants or your sweatshirt. It's a very versatile product. You just don't want to do it if you're in that high activity mode because you're going to need more containment, more control. Um, but for any time in low activity, you can definitely keep your tribute night on and it's super comfy. That's super great because again, people with edema, they need to do and have rest periods. So if you find like, again, if you're a low activity, just because they're classified as a night garment, they can be used throughout periods of the day that maybe you're not as active. Do you, we want to talk about the different options between doing the wrap versus the custom fit tribute? Definitely. So we've got our tribute wrap here and you can see here, this is actually our off the shelf design. And so we saw a tribute night, that's hundred percent custom, anything head to toe. But then we realized that we needed to have an off the shelf so that more people could have accessibility to evening, night, low activity garments. Um, and so what it was we designed this tribute wrap. So tribute night, tribute wrap, because it is a wrap. You can see here all these Velcro straps on here. And so this allows you to have a custom like fit, not a custom fit, but a custom like because you can adjust each of these individual straps to be able to fit the contour of the limb. Um, but it is for select styles. So it's really just for the arms and the legs for this off the shelf design. But let me tell you, there might be things coming down the road um, for other parts of the body as well. But that's kind of where we're starting here. And I'm actually gonna just jump in on here too, Lindsay. I really like the ability. So some people who have edema that is super out of control in the morning, you might be very small, but in the evening you might be very large. With a custom fit, it is, it is sized to the way how the fitter has sized you. But for example, if you have a massive flare up and it's very unpredictable, I would highly recommend the Velcro option for you because again, it kind of expands and contracts with you, giving you a little bit more flexibility. Whereas if you, if you weren't as uh, susceptible to the edema flare ups, then custom is an amazing option as well too. And one thing to add to that too, I think that's a really good point is that if you are someone that also highly fluctuates, um, that's also another good option is to have something that's adjustable because of that fluctuation, you can make sure it's always fitting. Of course, you can do Velcro for the custom product as well. So you can do it for both, but that's great for this. It's also really good if you maybe have limited therapy time or things like that, and you're wanting more reduction. Um, you may not wanna go into a custom garment right away because you wanna see further reduction. And I think let's just pause there because I'm going to assume there's some newbies on here. If you don't fit your custom garment or if you don't fit your garment, for example, if you've had a flare up and um, yeah, anytime you've had a flare up, all the garments that you would have had size at a smaller point are pretty much obsolete. They don't work for you. Same thing. If you lose the size and you were fitted at a larger size, 
that garment is not going to fit. So again, as you finally get down to the smallest base possible, which is possible, and that's the goal, you want to have compression that fits and grows with you until you get to the smallest point. So I will say that even through the process, if you're wearing a daytime garment, you're wearing a nighttime garment, you can still a lot of times further reduce even way after therapy. So I just want a quick share warranty wise. This is a six month warranty um, for many like defects or things like that that could possibly happen. Um, but the custom garment does have what's called a reduction alteration as part of our SureFit guarantee. So this is going to be one year, six months in the one year. Um, if you reduce in size, we do offer one free reduction alteration where the garment can actually be sent back free of charge and we'll actually take the garment into your improved measurements. So that's kind of a fun fact about Tribute Night. So it does come with that additional service. So it's kind of like getting two garments in the course of a year. I had to take advantage of that because I was at a very large size and I was very grateful that with that one year, you know, resize option that you guys refit to a smaller, po um, a smaller point. Again, that's huge. I'm so glad that you mentioned that. So thanks, Lindsay. What a great, great, fabulous option for people out there who do get that custom fit. Alrighty, so I'm gonna show you actually on my arm. It's a little easier to display this. So we can see here, we've got that below the knee, we've got your little sleep sleeve with the non-skid pads, but we also yeah. have this Keto Exilla. So one thing to know is all the Tribute Wrap as of last month, now have an additional size. We had a lot of feedback and people said, I really want a size extra large. And so now we did launch an extra large in every single style. So if maybe before you were maybe outside of the size range, you may want to check out that extended range um, now with that extra size. Great. And I, again, with this, um, I, this cover, I do enjoy the fact that with the, um, with the tribute wrap, even if I'm doing just daily functions, if I am having a rest period, I love that you do provide like a protective sleeve over top of it. Again, I don't love Velcro. I find Velcro gets into everything, whether you want it or not. So again, just basically protecting the garment, also protecting your other limbs, protecting your other fabrics from possibly getting on the Velcro. So it is just a nice feature that you do provide a sleeve to cover the garment, to protect anything that may get in its way. That's actually a good point. I know we mentioned this at the beginning is that we like to hear feedback so that we can really innovate, that we can make products be better for you. So actually the sleep sleeve didn't originally come with the garment. It actually just came alone, but we got so many phone calls from patients saying that they would wake up and get stuck to their pajamas or their bed sheets, sometimes their husband's pajamas, and it would pop off because of the Velcro. And so they had said, could you please give us a cover over the garment so that it could protect the Velcro from all the cat hair and dog hair and things like that but also so they're not having it pop up in the middle of the night because the Velcro would get caught to something else. And so now we include this free of charge in the bag with the product, um, but it was because patients had called in and said that this was a challenge. And so within one year of this being in the market, we made that quick change and now every garment comes with it. And that's because some patients came and decided to share their challenges so that they could help not only themselves, but also patients throughout the world. So that's something that's really important to us. So any feedback, whether you're sending it to our general mailbox, calling our customer service, emailing me, um, just please send feedback because that's how we can grow and help you better. Is there yep. anything else that we would want to keep on talking about these tribute wraps? I'm just going to quick show a couple things and just quick down it because I think that something I've found is that patients like to see it on the slide. So I'm going to do it really fast, but all of the tribute nine and wraps have this cool core material on the inside. So that's going to wick away sweat and moisture so it can stay cool and comfortable. What you're going to do is you're going to roll back all the wide straps and then just lightly fasten to the edge of the garment, all of these narrow straps. And you can see here, these little holes, those also were not originally on the garment either. We had little, little pull tabs on them, but patients said, it'd be really nice if you could just have a little hole on every single strap so that I could be able to put my finger in and get a better pull. And you can see here, every strap now has those finger grips. And that's also because patients called in. So if I'm gonna put this on, I'm gonna slide this onto my arm. You can see here, we've got this. I'm gonna get a nice pull. We're gonna adjust that around my wrist. And so you can see here, you wanna angle that. And then we're gonna do this one here. I'm a little short, as I mentioned earlier. So you can see here, it's actually a little higher. My elbow's here. 
um, but this garment's a little bit big on me, but you can still get the idea. And then you're gonna pull each of these wide straps and we'll apply this here and here and here. And then you can see you've got that custom like fit because you have that full adjustability, but it is in an off the shelf. And then you can put that sleep sleeve garment over top of it, which is just a really nice athletic type material. And so this can just be applied right over top. Perfect, I absolutely love it. And thank you so much for showing that. Okay, quick question that's popped in. Are these garments washable? Yes, they are. So the garments, both Tribute Night and Tribute Wrap are machine wash, machine dry. Um, and so one thing I do like to say though, is try not to put your towels and, you know, things like that, that like maybe could leave some lint on the garment. You wanna kind of just keep it maybe going by itself um, so that it's not gonna pick up all of that extra stuff that could maybe make the Velcro not as receptive or could leave pills on the garment itself. Um, but yeah, you can machine wash, um, machine dry these products. And so I would just say also low heat um, and then a mild detergent, no bleach. Um, or fabric softeners. Okay, how often should these be replaced? Yep, so the Tribute Night is going to be a one-year garment with the warranty. We have seen it lasting longer um, than that for some patients. And then the Tribute Wrap is a six-month garment. And honestly, I have to tell you guys, I had mine when I was, oh gosh, how old was I? I still <laughs> have my very first Tribute custom garment. It, it looks disastrous, but it, it's still slightly functional. And I think it all depends on how you wash and care for it. So again, even though that uh, Lindsay is safely saying within the manufacturer guidelines that it's a one year or a six month warranty, if you take care of these, these will go the distance. So again, don't just let that, she's saying what she has to say because she's employed by the company, but based on personal experience, I have been able to get years out of my garment. You want to see the impressions on your skin. And so that saying mm -hmm. that that the stretch of the garment hasn't really been overextended. You basically are going to see like all these little foam chip pieces that nestle into the skin, leaving a mark that lasts about 15 minutes on your skin. And that means that it's fitting right, that it's therapeutic still. And so just keep an eye out for that. You want to make sure that you don't get too much of the stretch lost in the tribute night, for example, for the one year garment, if you wear it over that, because you want to be able to see those impressions on the skin. So when you see the impressions, that means it's good and it's working and it's therapeutic. So just awesome. something for the uh, custom garments, you, you said that there's a Velcro option. Does that, and I think you were referring more so to the, um, to the, for the trunkle garments, but does that include all of the garments as well too? Any of the modifications can be used for any of the styles, whatever is needed. You can see here, we've got Velcro here, but you know, for example, I've seen Velcro up the thigh. And that's maybe because you have a thigh that's highly fluctuating. So you can add that there. And because we got so much feedback, you not only can get these adjustable panels, you can see here like that, but now we can actually do full adjustability anywhere on the garment that have these tribute wrap style straps with the finger grips on it for the custom as well. For the custom, you guys. So yes, you can get the Velcro on the custom. Now I have a question about the off the shelf, do these come in low profile? These do not, this just comes in the original profile and then the custom comes in either original or low profile. Question, are under sleeves needed for off the shelf? Under sleeves are actually not needed at all for the tribute night or the tribute wrap. You can put okay. over them to give more containment, but the inside of the material is called cool core and it's gonna help rapidly lick away the sweat and moisture. So you do actually wanna wear that directly against the skin. But I would say if you have any wounds present or some skin integrity problems that you wanted to maybe protect the garment for a period of time while things are healing, um, maybe you put like a light stockinette, like a TG tubular or something like that underneath that will just protect the skin, protect the garment um, underneath there. Why would somebody want to encourage or why would somebody want to know about the ready wrap and what are the benefits because of it? So a few different things here today, but I'm gonna just start with the calf piece. Um, so the things that are great about it, adjustable, so it's similar to the tribute wrap, but you can see a lot thinner. So this is a great product for the daytime. Um, you can wear it at night too. So it is versatile that can be worn day or night, but sometimes it's nice to get that foam action in the skin and nestling in the tissue, giving it that micro massage effect, helping support the skin health in the evening and night. Cause sometimes it's nice to have the different textures, but this can be worn both times. Um, but you can see here, if anyone has bandaged before, you know, feel free to write I in the chat box. I hope everyone at some point 
you know, went through that process. But you can see here, it has 50% overlap and it's built into the garment with the way that it's sewn. And so you're gonna get nice full coverage uh, like you would with, get with your bandaging. And also these straps are a short stretch material. So mm -hmm. like your bandaging, it's gonna have that high working, low resting pressure. And that's what makes it comfortable to wear both day and night. So unlike your long stretch, this is like your short stretch bandages. Um, I'm gonna put this here so I can show you the inside of it. And so you can see here when I said that 50% overlap, you can see here it's the way that it's sewn. And so you make sure that it's foolproof basically so you can't get any gapping. You can see this block support spine is really nice because it helps keep it supported on the limb. Sometimes if it's a flat wrap without this type of stitching built in, it starts to fall down, it sag during the day and you want your compression to stay up. And so this is really nice because this is gonna help keep it supported. And then anything you've noticed, any, any certain colors you've noticed, maybe the white, the light blue, the dark blue, that is to help you put it on. So you're gonna put the white, light blue, dark blue, white, light blue. And if you were taller than me, then you would have an extra top one that would be dark blue at the top. Um, but that's gonna help just kind of instruct you. So you can see here, we've got this one. I'm gonna put it on just to show a couple of the first straps. And then you can see you've got a little one and a big one. So you're gonna do a little one and then a big one of the light blue. And you can see it alternates every time. So you won't get that tourniquet effect where you're pulling it all in one direction because each time you're gonna start on the opposite end. So you'll just do that up the garment and then continue. So those are some of the cool key things about the ready wrap that make it great. But we do have some cool foot options, which we can talk about too, which are some of the newer things in the line. And before we get into the foot garments, this is very similar. And I, I hey, we're just going to go. This is very similar to a Circade, you guys. Again, Circade is based on Medi and what they offer. This is a ready wrap for what L and R offers. Now, the difference between the two, or I guess the functionality, is what we really want to look at. This is more so of a functional garment of something that we would want to wear during the day. What I have found from personal experience is, is that sometimes with more rigid material, sometimes with more support, and again, bandaging, we all understand is the gold standard, but the old way of bandaging with the soft, short stretch band, sorry, with the foam bandage, as well as a short stretch bandage, it's not necessarily easy to wear throughout the day. So this is what kind of replaces bandaging to give you that rigid support to allow you to decongest but also wearing it, you know, under your pants, under your skirts, or if you have it under your shirts for your arm. This also works really well when you do apply movement to help to reduce the size. So again, this is the L&R Ready Wrap. And again, it can be custom or it can be off the shelf. So it depends on what you're really looking for for functionality. And remember, these products that we're talking about today, they all have a purpose and it's up to you to figure out where you need to wear them and what's going to be best for your lifestyle so that you get the benefit of these products. So yeah, so this is a decongestive kind of, or even a, maintain, a maintenance product as well too. I use mine to maintain. I had, I've gone through my decongestive phase. I am now in the moment of the maintenance phase, but these also work great because there is so much customization. When I do have a flare up, this still fits. So it, it, it grows with me considering my edema is gonna be with me for the rest of my life. But the other thing that I really absolutely adore and it is a favorite product of mine, I do. So I actually am very fortunate. I don't have uh, swelling in my toes but I do still experience uh, swelling in my ankle. And my ankle was always a, a, a sore spot because I get jealous of women with really beautiful ankles. You know, like I look at women in heels or women that walk around and they have nice little teeny tiny ankles. This is the foot SL where I can now wear this. So this, we'll pretend this is my foot and this beautiful little garment here. Do we call it a garment? Sure, yeah. accessory. I'll call it an accessory. I like the word accessory better, but it actually slips into, thank you, Lindsay. It actually slips into your regular shoes, which is unbelievable considering most of our garments don't necessarily fit. So I can get the benefit of almost being wrapped, but by wearing a product that is meant to do as good as bandaging, if not better. I actually prefer this over bandaging. 
You can see it has that stretchy panel at the bottom. So it's going to be nice. So you can just slip it on, but it keeps that low stretch material better on the foot because it is designed for that. But I'm sure that we've got some gauntlets that could cover the hand. <laughs> but you can see that super simple. And then you can just slip your everyday footwear on. I have tried this in at least 25 pairs of my shoes just to check and make sure it fits. And I will tell you, it fits in all of them. <laughs> and, and honestly, because when I did bandage or when I do bandage, I find my feet so frustrating to bandage. So I actually put this first and then I bandage starting uh -huh. from my ankle upwards. So now I have traction and I can do what I need to do. And then of course, then I get more longevity because I do have swelling through my glutes and then I'll take it higher up into my glutes. Again, my foot and my ankle are fully supported and then continue up the process. So I actually do mix, mix and match my, my products, you guys, whether you guys like to hear that or not, but I don't just stick to the status quo. I use products. I love products. I find what works for me and then I make it customized to my lifestyle. But Lindsay, what happens if I have a lot of swelling on top of my foot? Do you have something that might be able to be a little bit more supportive? Because again, I know for sometimes I have extra foot swelling. Uh, do you have anything for that? So we actually just launched the Ready Wrap Foot CT. So foot SL is great for more of your mild to moderate swelling on the foot. But if you have a lot of swelling right there on the top of the foot that you need to manage, you need to get better control of, the foot CT is our latest option for that. So I can show you a quick little demo on my foot because I think the best way, I mean, the second way, the second best way, the best way is to be in person and seeing it, touching it, feeling it. So this is a medium regular right. So you can see here, it's got that white, light blue, dark blue. So you'll never guess we follow the same code down here. We actually have the finger grips on these ones because we found that people that maybe have more moderate to severe swelling, they want to be able to get a better pull um, on those straps. And so we do have those finger grips built in here. And so you can see it actually has a little spot for my ankle. And I'm going to just place my foot in there. And you can see you wear your toe caps with this type of garment or this type of accessory. You totally can put it on with this. Um, it does come with a liner just to protect the skin. I'm just showing it. You, it to you this way, just because it's easier to see, but you can sure. absolutely put your toe caps on with this. Yeah, and you would, and I would highly recommend, I would think doing the toe caps with the foot CT or the foot SL, depending on your, uh, your needs. And then again, continuing on with the rest of the garment, again, whether you're using the bandaging option, whether you're doing the ready wrap, whatever you need, again, these uh, products are just so multifunctional. And again, you don't just have to keep it at nighttime especially when these garments are meant to be do, do, worn during the daytime in your shoes. I remember getting bandaged for the very, very first time and nobody, nobody told me, um, I was laughing with somebody else about this, but nobody told me that my foot would be so swollen that I couldn't wear my shoes home. And of course that day it was raining. So of course my uh, CLT therapist, she had to put a plastic bag over my foot. And of course my, it's in my right leg, which is my gas pedal leg. And I'm driving with my plastic covered bag foot as I'm driving home. Again, it was a very depressing day in my life. And it's nice to know that there's other products out there that can help me take care of myself. And again, I don't have to wear a plastic Safeway bag on the way home. Question about the ready wrap. Uh, do the, does the ready wrap have a thigh high piece? And I can answer that. Yes, of course they do for sure. Definitely. They actually go all the way from the foot all the way up to the thigh. And again, you can get that custom or you can get that off the shelf. Do you have an upper extremity? We've got an arm and a gauntlet. And we also do have a toe piece as well. That's going to give some of that adjustability on the toe that you could wear with these foot pieces if you need to address that and maybe don't want to bandage or wear um, uh, toe cap. So that's another option too. But yeah, lower extremity and then the arm as well. So if you don't mind, I'm going to do a quick, really fast demo here so that they can see how this one works. You can see that gets that adjustability on the top of the foot. Then you can take this one, pull it across, pull this one, angle it, done. But you can see there's a lot more of that adjustability here to address that dorsum foot swelling where the foot SL didn't have that. But this is the Ready Wrap Foot CT and it just launched um, last month. And so you probably are the first people to know about this product. I feel so privileged. Thank you. Thank you, Eleanor. Thanks for, thanks for sharing us this news today. I love it. Um, okay, so Fusion Wrap, here we go. So this is the Fusion Kit. And so this wrap may look familiar. This is the Ready Wrap calf that we just showed. So nothing different here, but now we do offer the Fusion Kit, 
Um, and so that comes with a fusion liner. So maybe you have more mild swelling in your foot, or maybe you know you're gonna get some of that containment you need from your shoe, maybe like a tennis shoe with the straps or things like that. You can actually use this fusion kit and this liner underneath, it kind of looks like a dress sock, but it actually has compression in the foot all the way up to the ankle, which is where the ready wrap starts. And then it provides that compression with the ready wrap. And so this does come together in the bag. You can buy additional pairs of the fusion liners um, and that's an accessory, but you do get one with the fusion kit that comes with this and the wrap, or you could just do the calf, which is a liner without compression with the calf. But the fusion kit has been really a good favorite product because you can get that compression in the foot with just a sock. I don't know about anybody else out there, I do actually love protecting my skin. So, and again, some products and some fabrics, again, even though that they are meant to most of them are meant to go on the skin nowadays. I still do like having something comfortable, something silky, something soft to go in. So that's a fabulous modification that people can take advantage of. Um, again, helping you to make these products comfortable to wear because the key about compression is compliance. If you hate wearing it, you're just not gonna. So again, this is so great about LNR to offer us solutions to make things comfortable and functional and just everyday use products. Um, is there anything else that you would like to say about the fusion wrap, my dear? I was just going to say, so from here all the way up to here, there's not going to be any compression. And so that's just a liner. It's going to protect the skin. And then you can see it just goes on right over top of it. Um, and then I would just always, some people like to see the top band. So it's a really nice, comfortable top band here at the top. Um, I will say the ready wrap comes in black or beige, um, but the liners, whether that's the regular liner or the fusion liner, is only available in black. So just wanted to give a quick color breakdown as well. Fusion liner for those people that are thigh highs, does it go all the way up to the thigh? The fusion liner is only a below the knee option right now. Um, okay. But what you could do is you could do this and then maybe um, put like a stockinette or something underneath if you wanted to really use this instead. Otherwise the foot SL might be a good option for that. Um, if it's the full thigh high. Honestly, for all those waist trainers out there, not to say like I'm advocating waist trainers, but again, if for people with like truncal edema, this would be a fabulous product to be have as a truncal, a truncal trainer for sure. Is there anything else that you would want to talk about that we haven't already mentioned? Kind of recap the foot CT, foot SL. Um, those okay. are the two fusion kit and then tribute wrap and remember extra large now and then tribute night, of course. That being said, Lindsay, do you have anything to add? One quick thing I do want to say thank you to Trinity for joining us and for wearing all these fake garments today. And to Amanda for finally giving her a name. We've had her for many years and she's been <laughs> because of you. We have a name for her, Trinity. Um, but I just want to say thank you guys for joining. Thank you so much for showing up. Thank you, Trinity. Thank you, everybody else. You have a great night.